good morning friends today we come with a very interesting thing that is the publishing concept okay so so nowadays the gis is expanding the gis world is expanding and uh, we are now entering in the world of web gis okay so earlier whatever data analysis we are actually doing that is actually stored in our desktop platform only if someone will ask me okay uh, share your data we do the further analysis on that so then it will be very difficult uh, to give that data to him because i have to copy those the all data in a hard drive or pen drive and then we will have to share it okay so now there is a concept of dynamic map which will come to the picture so what you can do is you can create a web map and that you can share with anyone so now the question is today we will going to learn so many things in in future but at least we will learn how we are actually publishing our data in the website in arcgis online how we going to publish it so see here as you seen this is a uh, some maps will be there for world maps and these are the some volcanic locations will be there okay so these are the some volcanic locations will be there what i want over all these volcanic locations i want to publish in arcgis online so how we going to do that so to publishing it arcgis online so here we have options for the share okay in arcgis pro you have this share option so these are two things either you can create as a web map to publish or you can create as a web layer to publish so web map basically whenever you have so many layers here and that you want to publish as a web maps okay so then you can go and publish it as a web map but now suppose i have here only one layer only one layer that is volcanic eruptions spots so that i want to publish so i can go for the web layer okay so what i will do i go under web layer and i will just go for this publish web layer okay so just simply select it as a publish web layer so now once you click on the publish web layer so you have options to fill some form so you can give this name as a volcanic map okay so i am just giving same name as a summary volcanic map location i will select it as a feature types and then you can go for the analyze so there once you do the analyze there is a two things one is error one is warning so if warning is coming okay so it's upon you you can correct that our uh, warnings or not but if it is coming as a error okay so then you have to correct it one more thing you have to do that is you just go in this map okay if you go in a properties okay so you always allow this assignment a unique ids as a web layer okay so that you have to activate before you are publishing this okay so that's why when i am doing the analysis there is no no such error is actually coming here otherwise it may showing you the error okay so now once you analyze you are confident data is fine now you simply click on publish okay so let's wait for few minutes and let's see how it is published so now you just see now my layer is published so now let's we will going to check where this layer is actually published so simply click on this manage web layer so now it will going to open a new arcgis online so if you are not log in with arcgis online so simply log in with the same id and password which you are actually using for arcgis online so as i already logged in so see here my layers are now showing here right and suppose you want to open in a map viewer this particular layer so okay so simply click on open map viewer classics okay so simply click on this and you just see your map is published and it will be there okay so it will take few minutes time to upload and you just see okay so from here you can use this layer for various purposes you can create your own web apps okay if you want to create any web apps using taking this layer and most beautiful thing you know this web layer and web map so these are 
like scale specific not scale specific so you can zoom and you can see the exact locations where all these volcanoes are actually uh, located some are under sea some are overseas okay so all these uh, locations of the volcano you can very easily see now this is one thing now there is one more way you can publish or save your data as a map package okay so map package is also kind of a kind of a backup things you can do okay so map, map package is also saved in a online platform but uh, it you, you can't open it in a web okay so web layer we can open it as a web web map we can open it as a web but what is map package so see map package is kind of a it's kind of a you can say a container which will be saved in your web so if you want you can download it from the web and you can open it in arcgis pro again so it's kind of a backup so you just see this will be i'm giving name as um UNT, mountain mountain volcano okay so just i'm giving a name as a mountain volcano okay so now you can give name as a volcano and we can give some tags like hill then volcano okay again here also you have to do analyze okay you have to check analyze if there is any errors there is no error is such find out so you can simply click on package so let's wait uh, the time uh, by the time the package will finish then we will going to show you how it is looking like okay so now my package is also ready okay so let's see where it is there so simply click on the manage package and you can able to see that is same kind of uh, package is also store in your uh, access online okay so that is you just see here this is a package but you see the differences okay so differences is you can't open it as a web map here it is opening in arcgis pro or else you can download it you can share with anyone okay so if you want to share someone you have in arcgis online account and you want to share so that also you can do it okay so that is the differences of web layer okay and map package okay so now you understand it's kind of a backup of your work if you want you can store your work in arcgis online so that's all so if you have uh, any inquiry regarding this okay so if you want to see something okay so please mention in <coughs> in the comment box definitely i will try to reply your all the queries okay and uh, uh, we will come with a very uh, and so many good lectures in coming future please subscribe my channel thank you thank you very much